Hey, man, I told you I wrestled in college, right? Oh, yeah, sure. I know that, man. Yeah, well, um, you probably noticed. I, I got a cauliflower ear. It's like, it's one of the things that happens sometimes. And it's, I, I guess it's a deformity, but it's, it's not a big deformity. I mean, it's kind of minor, and it's just, uh, usually I'm not that self-conscious about it. It's just, why do, you, why do you have a guitar, man? What are you doing? Anyways, uh, these girls were at the mall, and I think I think they were po pointing at my ear, and, and I don't know, for some reason it bothered why, me. Why, why does everybody talk about my cauliflower ear? Well, not everybody. Just because there's just... damage to the cartilage in my tympanic membrane doesn't mean that I can't hear. Well, people always stop and stare at the bank or at the store. Not, not always. Not yeah. like I haven't heard those jokes 10,000 times before. There's, there's a few. Like, Hey, Greg, do you want some cheese sauce with that great big piece of produce on your head? Or, hey, does anybody have a vegetable tray? Well, we could just use Greg's ear instead. Well, yeah, I guess maybe Wait, jokes I got like... a couple more here. I wonder if Mr. Garden Cranium guy over here is ever going to find himself a chick. I do hey, maybe okay. he'll get lucky and find a girl with a nose shaped like a celery stick. Okay, are, are you done with the jokes? Yeah, I'm done for now. All right, well... The other thing, man, is this is weird, but it's just like I was pretty good, and you, you know I'm not a bragger, Henry. I'm just not that that way. But people assume that because I have an injury from a sport that I wasn't very good at that sport, and and that's not true. It must I, have been I, hard having a hobby where you're constantly getting your butt kicked. No, no, that's exactly the Don't opposite. Don't you think there's another what? hobby less dangerous that you could have picked? It's not a hobby. Like it's wrestling. Chess club, drama club, glee club, band, or even the debate team. I'd rather be called a geek than have a body part that my grandmother wants to steam. Yeah, funny. Okay, it's just, you know what, you can make fun of me or anybody can. I know what's inside is what's important, and I have that. And the, a little exterior, a very little exterior You can problem. rationalize it any way you want, but it still can't be it. denied. You got a great big ugly thing on your head and you can run, but you can't hide. I don't think it's necessary to hide. You could run a room in a friggin' vegetable crisper, but you're still gonna hear them whisper. You could live in a frigidaire, but they're still gonna stop and stare. You can run and you can cower, but you'll never escape the cauliflower. You're getting out of hand. Hour after hour, even in the shower, or at the top of a tower. Okay, now, now you're just coming up with rhymes for, for no purpose other than to just... Spicy, sweet, and sour. That, that's ridiculous. It doesn't even make sense. You, can, you can't fight the power. Fight the power? Like public enemy? Your uh, ear's been devoured, just like Dwight Eisenhower. Hey, did, did, did Dwight Eisenhower had a cauliflower ear? No, actually he didn't. And neither did Matt Lauer, or Adrian Cronauer, or Rutger Hauer. No, Greg, you're the only one who's ever had a cauliflower ear. It's hardly noticeable. I'll karate fight you. One Star Productions.